Hello, in this video I'll show you how to use uh, the Echo RRS plugin to create custom feeds for your blog. So, to demonstrate this, let's create some posts. Let's give them a title, some content and a category. Let's create another one. Content and another category. Okay, so now let's go to the post to RSS rules in the plugin. And here we can create uh, our own RSS feeds or Atom feeds. So let's uh, go ahead and give the feed a name this will be the name that uh, will appear also in the link of the feed so let's give it a name like this how many posts to show in the feed include full content or not in the feed of the post <coughs> how often should the feed automatically update and some advanced queries for the post search. I will show you in a while what this is used for. Let's save this feed right now and let's check it. And you will see that the two items that we just created are listed in it. <clears throat> and the link of the feed can be seen down in the corner left okay so now let's say i want to list posts only from the advice category so if uh, you remember i created a post with the advice category and in this case i have to enter like this uh, let's create another feed to demonstrate this Uh, like this and let's include also full content in the feed and check it out as you can see the full content is added now and also the only the uh, post is shown that matches the category that I selected the advice category uh, here in the advanced feed query you will have uh, quite a lot of uh, filtering possibilities uh, the options for this if you click here will be uh, almost limitless you can search and filter any post uh, from your blog and create custom queries uh, from them so you should use these as you can see category name appears here so you should copy this and this with equals between them and this applies also for the others so you can also use comma separated lists <coughs> and filter by author category and many 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 more uh, post parameters okay also you can create atom feeds let's create an atom feed and check what difference it has and this is our atom feed okay so this is all for the feed generation part of the plugin it is really simple to use and intuitive um, so until next time bye bye